Hey guys, welcome to Fear of Wine. We're starting a new LP with Supermassive's The Quarry. Uh, I've only beaten this game once, and that was a long time ago. And so we're going to try to run through it this time. We did kind of start it, but then we had to stop because Angela uh, ended up showing up here. So uh, we will be jumping on some streams here in a bit. I don't know why I'm telling you this, because by the time this gets released, we are, we'll have already released stream so whatever you know what? shut up oh god hold on die okay making sure that the streamer mode's on subtitles are on so it's all the same uh settings that i had before again this sounds very close to cigarettes after sex until the chick starts singing so if anyone doesn't know this game um they're going to a camp so it's very 80s slasher. Uh, there's a lot of big names in it. You got Lance Hendrickson, who played Bishop and Aliens. Ted Raimi, which is Sam Raimi's brother. You got David Arquette from the Scream series. Uh, Ethan Suple, uh, which I believe he's from um, American History X. Uh, John Q. You dig. We also got that chick from, like, Sinister. Or... I'll have to see her name when, it's, when it pops up. Lynn Shay, there you go. All right, Laura, Route 919, June 24th, as it said. Why'd you kill the music? Because it sucks. I think you know why. Um, <laughs> I don't think I do. It begins with an L? Like the L word? Lesbians? Lost, Max, we're lost. We're just, we're in geographic flux. Right, so, lost. That's debatable. Yeah, it's debatable, Laura. Oh, that's up. Oh, shit. Yeah, honey, nice catch. Alright, yeah, so they did a cute little video the last time, but since yeah, we've already played it now. Worse out here. I guess it's all part of the Didn't rustic summer time. camp experience. Oh, right, that's where we're going. I lost track like 200 miles ago. 200 miles ago, huh? Yeah. Yeah. You know what, Max, it's okay. It doesn't make you any less of a man. You know, if Columbus hadn't gone lost and landed on these golden shores, there would be no United States of America. Hmm. Goodbye hot dogs. See you later, apple pie. Columbus never actually landed in North America. What are you talking about? Didn't even know he wasn't in Asia. Are you serious? Just another guy who didn't want to admit he was lost. Well, just another guy who's got a whole day named after him, so... Put that in your pipe and smoke it. Oh my god. Okay, just get us <laughs> to camp already before I roll my eyes out of my head, please. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. <sighs> okay, so we're gonna go the good route. We're not gonna be a bitch. We're not gonna Were there be any directions on the flyer? No. Just a fake bunch of kids faking it around a fake fire pit. Just faking it? Checks out. Hear that whistle? <laughs> Everything okay? Yeah, okay. My nose is whistling. Hey, eyes on the road, mister. Oh! And foot off the gas, sir. Oh, she's in the back seat now.
Hmm. Well, that was a little mm-hmm. spooky. Yeah, yeah. I mean, still in one piece. Jesus That's good. Christ, what do you think that was? A bear? What? No, no, Max, it wasn't a bear. What was it? I think it was a person. Choo-choo. Oh, are you serious? <gasps> are you serious? Is it a person? He's gonna say, are you serious, like a thousand times in this. So. I mean, it was really cl- close, like really close, but maybe we didn't. What is it? Got a lot of damage. I really have this car up. Well, maybe it looks worse than it is. Uh, I should sure. check out the damage before we try to start it up again, huh? Could you grab my, uh, the, the toolbox from the trunk? Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. Chest gurgle. All right, hot stuff. Let's get out of here. Huh. Looks beautiful. Love the camera angle. Very nice, very nice. Okay, let's check the trunk. Should we snoop? Yeah, let's snoop real quick. Rejected. Thank you for your interest in Landis University. Oh, he got rejected from his college that he signed, uh, applied to. Probably embarrassed, Laura. Duh. I don't remember what the dude's name is. What's his name? I like the music. It's very Nightmare on Elm Street. Do you need a hand? Yeah, actually, if you could just shine a light right here. You got it, girl. Here you go. Perfect, thank you. The sooner we get out of here, the better. Just picture yourself curling up in front of a big old fire pit singing campfire sing-alongs. I don't think people curl up right in front of big old fire pits. Why not? Uh, <laughs> they don't want to catch on fire. And then, picture yourself <laughs> curling up in front of a big old space season. Well, That's more logical. Than here. Okay. Okay, there we go. Ooh. I don't like that. No me gusta. Where are you going? Just over here. A white girl of you. Stay there for a second, okay? I'm almost done. Defiant or compliant will be compliant. God, Max, hurry up! My God, Max, please just what's going on? Fix that really I'm fast. I'm worried that there's somebody down there. Are you serious? Oh. Yeah, they could be hurt. I don't know. I didn't think we actually hit anyone. Well, I don't know. I just I heard something. Okay, like a, a woman. Do you think we hit her? I just want to check it out. Okay. All right. Just don't go too far, okay? Be careful. Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. Luck with the car. Yeah, thanks. Good luck finding your ghost lady. Fool. So we found a tarot card. The fool. I wonder who this is. We all know a fool when we see one, don't we? Innocence and freedom, or recklessness and risk taking. Spontaneity, actions without thought, but the consequences to match. Think, think, and don't get burped. Okay. So let's look around. Huh? All right, we got a poster. Harem scarum. says, uh, this is a poster for a traveling sideshow. It looks like this has been here a while. Love forgotten in the woods. Are those burn marks around the edges? I mean, it just looks like an old fucking poster. You know, worn and torn from the weather, but sure. Wait, 
Do we we didn't miss something back here, do we? For some reason I thought there was somewhere here. Also, hold on. When we first walked down, when we got the tarot card, it looked like there was a left and right path. Oh no. Okay, we just got dropped down. And... Oh yeah, it was a left and right. So if we had gone the right path, we would have missed the tarot card. Yeah. Yeah, I will say I remember. So you visit a lady, I believe, and she tells she reads her tarot cards. I think almost every single time she was like, oh, you don't have any tarot cards. Okay. Like, I never fucking found them. They made it a little too hard to find them in this game. So I'm probably going to Google them this time. I want us to get as many tarot cards this Let's Play. Escapology trunk. So a trunk filled with strange devices. That of an escapolo escape escapologist, perhaps? A relic of a traveling show that must have passed through the area. And they just dumped off a lot of stuff. Posters and trunks for the escapologist. So I guess he's not doing his next act. We be asking him where his shit is. He goes, I don't know. So I dropped him in the woods somewhere. That big old 50 pound truck. the dog boy. It's pretty creepy. Silas. What? Not only that, you just saw a tr uh, thing that said Silas the dog boy. Then you hear somebody whispering it out in the woods. I don't know how many red flags you need to, to get out of there, but I guess count that as one. Oh, count that as... This too. Okay. Okay. I hope she's like remembering where she came from, right? Thank you. Run, bitch. It's okay. It's the woods. There's a lot of stuff out there. There's animals. It's easy to freak yourself out. No. Can we just leave, please? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go. Okay. You all right? Yes, there we go. Burn like a kid. Max, come on! Here we go, here we go. We're getting out of here. All right, good. Oh. Are you kidding me? Max! I just, okay, give me a minute. Give me a minute. We've got to go, man. Right, you're not helping right now. Can you just... I am trying to... 
to get us out of here. All right, just... enough. You're not getting us out of here by screaming at him, okay? Come on. I'm sorry. Dumbass. I'm trying to get us out of here by screaming at your ear and panicking you, okay? How's that not working? We're okay. We're safe in the car, really. We're gonna be okay. Jeez! Oh, ah! fuck. Oh my god, my heart just exploded. Roll it down. It's Ted Raimi. Hi, officer. With How blood on his neck. Are either of you injured? Really, we're fine. We're just a little shaken up. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, you folks want to tell me what happened here? Path chosen. Let's see. Oh. Oh, the, these are all uh, Beckett's little Beckett's story pictures. is full of twists and turns, unknown paths, and mm -hmm. unexplored wonders. With each step taken, you tread a path of your own, matched with its very own consequences. There will be moments Jesus. throughout your stay that show you that the choices you've made, the path you've chosen, could have gone another way. At Hackett's Quarry, there's no such thing as the wrong way. But be warned, some paths are more dangerous than others. Nice. Okay, hold on. So what's the other stuff? Interrupts? Okay, so those haven't popped up. At certain times throughout the night, opportunities will present themselves, giving you the chance to take matters into your own hands. It is worth noting that they are only suggestions. You don't have to act upon them. In fact, sometimes it's better not to. Yeah, we uh I mean these are lit up, so I assume that we've come across these. We're not gonna we're gonna wait till till those. Yeah. Um Evasive or honest? Let's see. Let's do honest. We um uh, something jumped out right in front of the car and we didn't want to hit it, so we swerved and now here we are. Something jumped out. Uh, we'll be honest. Uh, I'm sorry, it was, it was so dark and it happened so fast and they were gone. I don't know. The hey. lip syncing is terrible. Ma'am, did you hit someone? No, no, God, no, of course not. You know, I mean, I don't think so. I don't, I don't know. Sir? Path chosen. Keep the car running. Cop Sir? seems anxious. Is this kind of like the all-time scariest cop? I don't know. This is my first cop. What, like ever? Uh, yeah, I'm not a criminal. You ever been pulled over speeding or just anything? Wow. Good at Tisha's ass, bitch. But, um... Yeah, we're gonna hit him with nothing but honesty. And see where... See what happens. Oh, also, looking at the quarry guide, uh, brought to you by IGN. <clears throat> that was the only tarot card, this one. Now, you folks want to tell me just what in the hell... We don't have another tarot card until chapter one. All the one. way out here, this late at night. Um... Friendly or we'll do friendly. We're heading up to Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. We're new counselors. You're one night early. No, no, we know. Um, but we figured we'd get in early and scope it out. You know, I mean, they know we're coming. We called ahead. And to be honest, sir, one of us kind of oversold their navigation skills and got us completely lost. You're not going to make it to Haggett's Quarry. Not tonight. Harbinger Motel. It's the nearest place you can bump Harbinger. up Harbinger, Jesus. Okay? Uh, 
I think we're just gonna stick to the plan, sir. I mean, Mr. Hackett knows we're coming and we called ahead. No, ma'am, you're gonna head to the Harbinger Motel. Do you understand? Insistent or compliant? I will be compliant. Okay, fine. Yeah, we'll head to the motel. Understood. Uh, there's just one small problem. Uh, I forgot to spring for the middle of nowhere coverage plan on my phone. What he means is we're lost completely. All right, ma'am. Step out of the vehicle. Wait, what? Um, I just want to show you how to get to the motel on your map there. Okay? For sure. Son, remain in the vehicle. I just want your girlfriend out here by my, by my side in the dark, please. Okay. I ain't got them wandering hands. Okay. 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 So we like the way I licked that pencil. <laughs> All right, about here. Harbinger right. Motel is here. Right. Okay. And where was Hackett's quarry? Uh. Well, I'm sure the fine folks at the Harbinger Motel can guide you there. First thing in the morning. Right. It's only slightly distracting. The, one, the teeth and the lip syncing. It's a little distracting. I feel like they, like me and Angela are currently playing uh, Little Hope, and I think the lip syncing's fine there. I don't know what the deal is with this game. Harbinger Motel. Stay on the road. Wait, but, but what if there's someone out there? Yeah, I'll have a look. Good night. Good night. Why is this guy just sitting there? So, right. Let's see. Annoyed or relieved? Relieved. That guy was giving me major weirdo The dude needed like at least a dozen shots. Oh my god, I know. What was up with the thing? Did I you see was, that? Was it blood? Nice to meet you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Vince, you're like making a ding. Stop it. All right, let's get back on the road. Yes. I think I've had enough woodland encounters for one night. Thank you very much. Agreed. So where's this motel? Okay, so we're here, mm -hmm. and the motel is here. Okay. But we're going. Vince, I'm about to pull one eight seven on a cop. Okay. Hackett's quarry. How'd you do that? I don't know. I kind of tricked him into showing me. <laughs> very slick. Are you sure we shouldn't just get to the motel and just listen to this guy's advice? Honey, you really want to listen to the advice of some creep-ass cop who told us in the middle of the creep-ass woods to go to some creep-ass hotel? No, that sounds terrible. Yeah. Let's hit the road, shall we? That's what I thought. Ma'am? Oh my god! If he called me ma'am one more time, I was gonna shove that badge up his dick. <laughs> Seriously, Jesus. do I look like a ma'am to you? I got like 20 years before I'm a ma'am. Mm-hmm. What? I 20s debatable. And you can be called ma'am at any age. That's like a. Okay, we're done. <laughs> I don't understand that logic. It's like, oh, I'm not a ma'am. Yeah, I know all the dings on the stream. I said I'm about to pull 187 on a fucking cop, if Vince. <laughs> it's all good. Let's see. Heck, it quarries summer no camp. I know. I'm fine. I'm streaming in this yet again, and I promise this time it's going to be a full let's play. Did you actually even talk to Mr. Hackett, or did you just leave a message? Well, what's the difference? This. This is the difference. <laughs> what's the difference? I left him a message, and he didn't respond, or he responded, and well, he knows we're coming. What's the difference? You just said the difference, you stupid. How was I supposed to know that? What a stupid woman. I mean, clearly there's somebody here. Yeah, or it's just an abandoned car, and this is a complete waste Why of time. Why would there be an abandoned... 
I'll be at the car. Max, come on. Max, don't be a dick. I'm sorry. I mean, clearly he's being the dick. <laughs> I hate this chick. This is the moments where I'm like, oh, I, I can't wait till she dies terribly. I'm not gonna make it happen. Is anybody but I'm home? not gonna be sad if it happens. Yeah. Is anybody home? Okay. Ghost day. Alright, well. I already pretty much know what's gonna happen here. We're at the end of the stream, so we're gonna just kind of fast forward this bullshit. Let's go check down here. Is Luna here? <laughs> so <laughs> it sounded like a baby crying. I was like, what the fuck? What's going on? Like, are you serious? Bring some tools so we can break the lock. Hey, I'm back. We're gonna get you out of there. Whoever you are, whatever you are. Wait, what, what are these? I don't know. You just said tools. Why didn't you just bring? The... Look, there's someone in there. Uh, I'm not seeing anyone. Wait, no, look. I'm looking. I am. There was definitely someone there. Okay. Okay. So. Uh, let's do the hammer. It's blunt force. Hammer time. You sure? It's going to be super loud. Indecisive or urgent? Urgent. So? Someone's trapped. So all this woman's decisions are just damning them both. Like, she is the shittiest girlfriend on the planet. You need a hand? Yeah. yeah she's just, she's gonna screw them both and... Yeah. Okay. Right into a fucking cellar. No, thank you. You've seen Evil Dead, right? Yeah, no shit. Hello? Are you hurt? Do you exist? Hey, be careful. I'm gonna wait right here and just, uh, you know, make sure they don't run out the exit. Are you Ian? No, I'm Pablo. Oh, let's check this out. Bloody collar. The bloody collar looks too big for a dog. What kind of dog would be called Ian anyway? Huh. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. Hmm. Huh. Oh. For the love of Max? Max, there's a fucking rib cage down here. <laughs> oh my god, run. Like, just run and get out. Like, why... What are we even doing here? Are we still looking? We're still gonna search around, even though there's a... This makes no sense. Hun, maybe it was a possum or something. No, there was... There was someone here. Is so... she not gonna report on the rib cage? It's been kind of a night. You know? 
Let's just get to the motel. We can come back here first thing in the morning. We can check everything out, but... I mean, you must be exhausted. I know I am. I think our imagination... Oh! Max? How did she see the Max? rib cage and was just like, Nah, I'm not even gonna say anything about it. It was a fucking human being or something just eating on the ground. Max! Yeah, you just killed your boyfriend. Oh, oh God, yeah, he's dying and you're a bitch. You better help him. You leave Max, you're a piece of shit. I want to help random strangers, but not my boyfriend. Path chosen. Your boyfriend's been shot and killed, probably that animal too. And now you've been drugged, so. The quarry. This is definitely not the music I would have picked to open my horror game up, but. Hey, man. Hey, they're being funny. <laughs> Isn't that funny that we're playing some kind of salsa over our horror opening title card? Ugh. Alright, guys. <laughs> Oh, hold on. <coughs> huh. Hello, my friend. Welcome to the show. We are friends, aren't we? Uh, sure. I mean, I just met I've you. I waited for ago. you. Oh. I've waited. Yes. So I do hope our time together proves enlightening. Agreed. There's no need to worry. I'm here to help you. Think of me as your guide into the unknown. It's exciting, yes, and terrifying. But if you're brave enough, if you let me help you, I can help you. We can help each other. Oh. This is the card you found. Yes. Yes, it is. The, the fool. fool. I wonder who this is. We all know a fool when we see one, don't we? Innocence and freedom. Oh, my God. Is it going to be the thing I read on the card? Risk-taking. Spontaneity. Actions without thought, but the consequences to match. Think, think, and don't get burnt. I can show you more if you'd like me to. Um, uh, see more. This is what might come to pass. A possible future. A path yet unchosen. Look okay. Here.
There are secrets out there, you know. Secrets and lies. Paths to uncover on which I can shed light, if you let me. Help me help you. And remember, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Okay. That's cool, I guess. Alright guys, that's going to be the end of part one of our Let's Play of The Quarry. We'll be back with part two very soon. I hope you guys are enjoying this. Let's check out this cam next time. Until then, peace. <laughs>